Diversity in the workplace. This will help you to answer assessment criteria 1.1 on the assignment 3 RTO. The CIPD states that managing diversity is based on the concept that people should be valued as individuals for reasons related to business interests as well as for moral and social reasons. It recognises that people from different backgrounds can bring fresh ideas and perceptions which may make the way we work more efficient and products and services better. When we consider a diverse workforce, it's important for us to include people with different abilities, religion, marital status, race, age, sex and gender, values and cultural beliefs. Some specific examples of how a diverse workforce can have a positive impact on business performance are People from different religions may bring with them knowledge about their own religious belief, cultures and traditions. This can be capitalised on and built upon with regards to business performance. People of all different ages are likely to bring different life experience with them into the organisation. For example, young people may enter the organisation bringing a wealth of technological knowledge with them. People from all different backgrounds will help to grow and strengthen the company's ethics and value system. The reasons why diversity matters in business include improving customer care and increased market share. If we have a diverse workforce which reflects our customer base, we're likely to have insider knowledge of the requirements and wants of our customers. Another reason is that we're able to develop organisational ethics and values as we ask our diverse workforce to contribute. It can help us to enhance people management practices, it can reflect changes in society and it can help us to comply with legislation. In some organisations there are quotas around the diversity in the workforce. It can also help us to keep up with best practice, to attract and retain talent and help us to enhance competitiveness. If we recruit and select people from a diverse workforce based on the fact that they are the best person for the job, rather than just trying to achieve quotas, they are more likely to value the organisation and remain with you. Look out for the next video on the factors that affect an organisation's approach to attracting talent, which helps you to answer assessment criteria 1.2.